Hey there guys, how you doing? It's Drew here and today is day number 405. Uh, this is a weekly update video. So this was, uh, this is actually um, the result of one week guys. So this, this is my best week so far um, inside S Group. A little over 3,000 US in profit, um, which in my currency is uh, I think about 3,600 or something like that dollars in a week, which is pretty damn good. So um, we're gonna do another withdrawal in this video here. Uh, I'll just withdraw this commission. I'm gonna let this thing ride here for uh, the full four weeks, just so that when people are watching these videos, you know, that that uh, week number four of, of the month or whatever, the 30 days there, um, they get a really easy uh, understanding and idea of what 50K can do in this system, right? So um, we'll get going here. So I guess it'd be a little over 50K because this this uh, number here earns as well too. So that's why I was saying in some of the videos there, I say like, um, you know, it's actually like about 55K the last week of the the month there. And I'm going to re actually, you know what? It won't land on exactly 30 days, that video, um, because I'm going to go uh, uh, February. February 1st, I'll actually go and reset my account back to zero. So it might be like three and a half weeks or something or three weeks. So here's <coughs> the end of, <coughs> sorry, Ooh. I still have my cold. Oh, I got to tell you guys about my coronavirus. So I had the coronavirus. I had it for two days. My son had it for about, I don't even think he had it for 24 hours. You know, like we woke up in the morning, we were both kind of like, oh, our back hurts, you know, let's see what's going on or whatever. We both took the test, the rapid test for Corona. We both had coronavirus. Um, <clears throat> and I was like, uh, maybe halfway through the day, I was kind of like, you know, like I, I didn't want to go outside and shovel the driveway or anything like that. I just wanted to kind of like chill out on the couch, but you know, nothing really bad you know, a bit of a headache, my back hurt and I wasn't coughing or anything. Didn't feel any chest pains or anything like that, but I tested positive for Corona. So it was kind of weird. Um, uh, and then, uh, you know, the next day I was pretty much okay. Right. Like feeling normal again, kind of thing. My son, the, that night, um, totally fine. Like running around the house, like normal six-year-old, right? <laughs> it's just insane. It's hilarious. And they're, they can't even go to school because of coronavirus. Like it's just, it's, it's completely crazy in Canada, guys, this coronavirus stuff. So my wife, uh, tested negative for coronavirus, but she has a cold. So now I got her cold. So I had the coronavirus and then now I've got a cold and I've actually had this cold the whole week and it's way worse than the coronavirus. I'll tell you that. Um, the variant we got, we got that like Omicron variant or whatever it's called. The one it's like nothing serious at all kind of thing. So, <clears throat> um, yeah, guys don't, I wouldn't be afraid of coronavirus if, if you haven't had it, you know, don't really be afraid of it. If you're in good health, if you're, you know, um, not s severely obese basically, or if you're not super old, I, you know, I wouldn't really be that much that, that afraid of it. So it's probably best that everybody just gets it and we get over it. So yeah, so you can see here, guys, I reset my account uh, down to zero. We did a, a big withdrawal. Well, 3300 bucks there was, uh, I think that was about two weeks earnings or so. And we did a withdrawal. You can see the, the earnings there. And then I have a little bit of commission there. Did a withdrawal in this video here. Set my account back down to zero, as you saw there. Had a dollar, 99 cents in it. And... Yeah, guys, this is day 405 today, and uh, like crazy commissions came in this week. Um, basically, I had a, about a, a 1,000, I think it was like $1,046 commission come in, a 13% commission from someone um, that decided to make their uh, investment, you know, and uh, so that would have been like a ten thousand dollar investment or so or nine thousand something and yeah i got a huge commission from that of course so um the, you know there was that and then a bunch of just other little commissions that came in every single day throughout the week there that added up to about 700 and something about 720 bucks there um yeah so 1768 dollars in commissions this week guys and then the earnings this week um where i would say they're average earnings 
this week. As you can see here, we had, you know, um, well, it's, it's hard to see the days um, exactly there, but the, that's the back on the fourth. Um, yeah, so it would have been, it's hard to get there. So there's the 10th was a 0 0.40. <clears throat> see if we can get the 11th. You got to move it. There you go. 0 0.47 was the 11th. The 12th was 0 0.83, which was good. And that kind of set us to our average earnings, you know, and then today, uh, or sorry, yesterday we had a 0 0.72. And then today we had 0 0.51. So you can see there it's, you know, those two days that were above 0 0.60 basically uh, brought us to an average because we did have a couple days that were like 0 0.40 something there. So yeah, uh, $1,269 this week in just the uh, the profits from investment there. Pretty cool. So in this video here, guys, oh, I got to shoot over to the careers page because I actually did pass that, well, blew past it when I got that $1,000 commission. Um, the uh, quarter million dollars there. So now I'm at two two 265,000 there and I've got two, I've got 234,000 to go. And then I'll get a $20,000 bonus. I am talking to two people that are, um, they say they're going to fund very, very big, like a 50,000 and a 30,000 guys. Um, how I take it, you know, guys, you're going to at least once a month when you start promoting and referring and stuff like that and team building and people are joining you, you know, every day someone's joining you kind of thing. Um, you'll notice that you will get a lot of people like at least once or twice a month, someone will join, they won't fund, they'll create their account and they'll talk to you like every single day for like a month straight about, oh, that they're going to fund 30K or they're going to fund 50K and blah, 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 um, that type of thing, guys. Um, most of the time, they don't fund at all, those people that talk like that. I don't know what it is, but I don't know. But anyways you know, what I'm always saying, guys, is just, you know, talk to everyone, you know, if they're talking to you, even if they sound crazy or whatever kind of thing like that. Um, <clears throat> not that these guys are crazy. Actually, one of them, the guy that wants to fund 50K, I've known for a while. Um, so I, you know, pretty confident that he will fund that much. And that's going to like shoot this number up here. But a lesson I learned a long time ago, guys, was that the people who are, you know, always messaging you and talking to you about that they're going to fund a lot and stuff like that. Normally, those people don't. They don't do anything. Normally, the people who fund a lot are people that come in, uh, they join, they fund like a hundred bucks or a thousand dollars or something like that. They reach out to you. They say hi, blah 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 blah. You only have about one or two messages uh, between each other, and then they fund like ten or twenty thousand dollars. That's what I've noticed. Like not 20, ten or twenty thousand right away but 10 or 20,000 over like the year or something like that, or over the six months um, that they're, uh, you know, in there like funding their account out of pocket kind of thing, building it up. So that's kind of what I've noticed guys. Or it's, you know, if you've been promoting a long time, um, you know, the people who are big funders are the people that actually know you, right. That uh, maybe joined you in something else or, or something along those lines. So yeah, just the lesson I learned when I first got introduced to this online marketing stuff. Normally the bullshitters are the people that just, you know, they talk to you for a month or two straight and do nothing, <laughs> right? So, um, you know, when someone messages me and they're like, oh, I'm going to put 50K in this or I'm going to, you know, oh, I'm going to fund $10,000, you know, the end of this month, I'm going to do it, blah, 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 blah. Um, normally what I do is I try and really explain to them about investing and about compounding, right? That... Um, you know, because normally that's how you'll, you'll catch a bullshitter is if you can explain to them about the power of compounding and that, you know, you don't need to go and put 50,000 or 30,000 or whatever, um, into an investment system, put what you're comfortable with, like put five, if you're thinking you're going to fund 30,000 or 50,000 or whatever, put 5,000, put 10,000 and then compound for six months. And then if you feel, yeah, I want to put more, then put more kind of thing. And, you know, if people, you know, if that person gets back to you and they're like, oh, I, you know, I really like what you're saying and, and blah, 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 that type of thing, guys, then normally 
that's when you know, okay, this is a serious person. But if they get back to you and they're like, oh no, I just, you know, I'm going to fund 30K or, or 50K or whatever. And just from day one, because that's what I, uh, I'm going to do. And I got lots of money and, and all this stuff. Then, you know, just kind of leave them alone, let them do their thing because those are normally the people that are not going to fund at all. They ju- they're just talking to you for a month straight. So yeah, let's get going here, guys. We're going to do a withdrawal. Um, I was going to take this uh, 1700 bucks here and I was going to do this, the SNT uh, striking or staking or whatever. But um, I talked to my wife today and I, I told her, hey, I'm going to give this a shot. It's it's something that, you know, never done. And, and I'd have to get that $100 mess, uh, $100 uh, monthly membership fee too there to have, to hold 10,000 tokens. You need the $100, $100 a year uh, thingy there. So I was going to do that. Um, and then she talked me out of it because she's like, no, no, I, I'd rather, you know, have that money in our savings, which is kind of stupid. If you ask me, like if I did that striking with it, I could probably make, I don't know, uh, 150 bucks this next 30 days without doing anything. <laughs> so, but you know, it's, it's fine. I told her all the money from this account she could have. So that's that. And what I've realized is I probably can't withdraw in this video because, It's only 10 o'clock, and if I go to the finance page, yeah, they're still doing their order of operations. So I'll probably just make another video and call it my withdrawal video, guys. Um, It's better just to have a bunch of content anyways, but that's it for uh, this update here. As you can see, this one was set back to zero uh, last week. And then we're five days or, you know, four days later, actually, it's the Friday. And I think I made that video on the Monday, um, but Friday is the end of the week. Uh, yeah, guys, over 3K. Let's just add this up here because this is pretty freaking amazing. Like if this happened every single week, man, that would be crazy. But I'm not expecting it to happen every week because... Uh, that would just be a little extreme to do something for one year and then make like 10K US a, a month. That might be a little much. So 1768, 1768, like I mean 10K a month and I'm basically not doing anything. Guys, I just worked my ass off at this for the first, well, you can go and you can look, right? Like it's pretty simple to figure out how hard I worked at this. Now I'm doing a video a week, which is nothing. It's just me, you know, of course I'm making content and still getting referrals for my content and stuff like that and giving people the opportunity to follow for the last year or so, year and a half. (laughs) But uh, yeah, guys, like I stopped doing my daily review videos of S Group way back here. Like, look, at this was eight months ago. There you go. There's the last daily review video, which was, yep, no more above there. Um, oh, no. Look at day 163, 164. I just stopped using the the uh, thumbnail. Uh, 65, 69. These are both called 69 for some weird reason. 70, 71. I think it was like, Oh, this is when I was charting BTC in video, which wasn't getting me any views, so I stopped doing it. Um, 64, 66, 93, 92. These are kind of messed up here. Some of these days are a little messed up. Three, four. Oh, okay, so here. Yeah, so like around day number 300 or so, because you can see here it goes... 304, 310, 314, 327, 347. Why are these days all over the place? 349, 355. Yeah, so around day number 300. So like for 300 days, basically, I did a video a day that you can see there, which, you know, that is a lot of work and such. But would you do a video a day for, that's basically what it is. Watch this, okay? So basically, I did a video a day. Some videos I did were, I don't know, I think the longest daily review video I did was maybe 40 minutes long or so, 
and most of them were, I'd try and keep them like under 25 to 30 minutes, you know, and that made me, uh, like a passive income of commissions because I make commissions every single day. Um, but you know, 30, 30,000 us, which in my currency is probably, it's definitely above minimum wage. It's probably like having three jobs at minimum wage, maybe in my country. Um, cause I think minimum wage is like 12,000 a year or something like that. I don't know guys. I haven't had a day job in like how long since 2000, 2009 was <laughs> the last day job I had. So like <laughs> a really long time ago, 13, 14 years ago. So we got that USD to C80. And guys, I'm not showing you this to be like, Oh, blah, 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 kind of thing like that. I'm just showing you this to show you exactly what I did, right? For a promotion and you know, all that. And I'm trying to encourage you to do it. Right. If, cause here's the thing, most of the people that are watching these review videos, they're not looking to join S group. Most of the people that are watching them are members of S group, but 3%. We, I did a video explaining that only 3%, like we did the math and we looked into how many people were at each level, uh, in the system and all that kind of stuff with, I mean, the promotional end of things. And we figured out that it, I think it was under 3% of the member base was actually promoting this thing. So, you know, by me going and showing you my results and stuff, guys, and, and, you know, what work it took to get, uh, this, this result here, guys, um, it might encourage people. So in my currency guys, yeah, almost $40,000 in my currency. Okay. That's just the commissions, right? So that's pretty cool. So if we go, oh man, I forgot to add that stuff up. Oh no, I did. It was 3036 bucks. Okay. So we go here. Yeah. So $3,036 is what it made uh, with the commissions, of course. Don't want to beat around the bush and say like, oh, my, my 50,000 made me 3,000 this week. Um, my commissions, and I made more commissions than I my monthly income was, which was my weekly income, right? Cause I reset that to zero, uh, in the last video, four days, five days ago. So yeah, pretty awesome guys. 3,030, 34 bucks. Let's just see if this thing's done. Cause it would be good to No, It's not. So I'll come back tomorrow and I'll do a withdrawal video of this seven. It might be 1800 bucks by the time I do it. Um, but we'll withdraw that to the S wallet. I did withdraw my which this is, this is content that people would actually really want to see is my S wallet content. Cause I did a withdrawal. I withdraw like all the funds out of my S wallet basically to, for my wife to pay the mortgage. Um, I left, man, my nose is itchy. Sorry guys. Oh, coronavirus gives you a dry nose. That's another thing. (laughs) So, um, my, I, I sent all the, the Bitcoin and stuff to my wife's account and it's now in her bank. So there you go. Yeah. So I left 1,266 uh, $1, bucks in there. Um, yeah. So I left $316 in USD and then, uh, B and B, you know, uh, basically every week guys, I'm buying $200 of crypto is my game plan. And I've got to buy $200 of crypto today, actually to stick to my game plan. And this is how I'm building up. Cause I want to show, you know, how to build a passive income. And one of the passive incomes that I use guys is cryptos as well, right? Like long-term holding cryptos. Okay. So now's not a great time to buy that on the daily chart, but we'll look on the four hour, the four hours coming down. Yeah. So in tomorrow's video, I'll go and I'll buy $200 of crypto just because I don't want to buy right now, I probably could get another buy down here at 4,200 bucks. Looks like it'll come back down to 4,200 and I'll just buy some, I don't know. Let's go see in what, uh, what, what we might buy here. Eh, I've got 400 bucks of Tron that I bought. These are each $200 buys, right? So my Ethereum has gone up two bucks. My Bitcoin has dropped, I don't know, 15 bucks or so or 20 bucks. My BNB dropped about 10 bucks and my Tron dropped, uh, $20, which if it's only $400, that's actually a lot, <laughs> which is still not that bad because we're actually in a big up cycle pretty soon. 
we're going to have an up cycle. If we look at the weekly chart, the weekly chart's way down here. And this is what I think will happen. We'll make this video a little bit longer than I attended to. But um, <clears throat> looking at the Bitcoin chart, if we look at the, the weekly chart, guys, you can see this is a one week chart. I've got all my levels in here and this chart has basically not changed for the past, I don't know how long, maybe three or four months. Um, this chart has not changed ever since the price of Bitcoin has been around here. This is what's been on my chart. These lines might change every now and then, or I might add a lower line if the price action comes down. Like I just added this line here, um, this, this past week. So if we can stay here, we're probably going to get a leg up to here and get rejected. If say, for instance, we come up to here and this stotch, this price action is now up here, like, you know, a month, two months, three months later or something, right? Like we get something like this could possibly happen where we just go sideways here. Okay. Which that's what I think will happen. I think we'll get something like this where we just come in this range. Who knows? We could get a, a dip down to, you know, would probably find support around here somewhere. Um, and then we have something like this and then we go back up or this could just turn up like, we'll try and find like this, right? We could just turn up and do one of these again and then create another leg up which would take us either back up to here to 50 K or take us back up and actually create a new all time high with Bitcoin. I feel it's going to do something like this. I feel that we're going to get like a $36,000 Bitcoin buy and buy down there. And then we'll move up and, you know, either get rejected around 50 K or so. Right. And think of this guys, if we get back up to 50 K, then what I would simply do is I take profit on all these, right? Like all the cryptos, um, you see me buying $200 of crypto every single week. If the price of Bitcoin simply moves up to 50K, which it will this year, definitely, right? If it simply moves up to, to 50K, which is not that big of a move, and I'm every week I'm buying $200 of, you know, these cryptos over here that we have in the S wallet, and eventually I'm buying even down here, right? But the majority of it I've bought up here, we come down, if we come down here, right? I get my $200 buy that week, I buy down here. We're gonna move back up. And by the time we get around 50K, right? This here, these will all be in like mega profit, right? Because the worst buy throughout these was around uh, 48 to 46,000 in Bitcoin. So if we simply move to 50K, then I've made pretty damn good profits. I'll look at the chart might make the decision, hey, yeah, I'm going to uh, sell at this 50K rejection. Who knows? We could break through and keep on going up. But if I simply, you know, just sell everything here or sell just 50% or whatever, I'm in some pretty nice profits if I'm buying all through this, if we end up coming down here, right? And bouncing around here for six months. Who knows what could happen, right? But eventually over this next year with the crypto plan that I'm doing, we get a $50,000 sale and I've been buying $200 a week while it's bouncing around down here, boom, I'm uh, off to the races. And that's just another uh, little, you know, nothing to write home about, but a little other income stream that I can do. Um, that's really, really easy to, you know, if you guys want to get into crypto trading, that's a really simple thing to do is just buy uh, once a week when we're low, that's it, right? Look at the chart. If the daily chart is low, we'll go to the daily chart here. Like right now, you don't want to buy, it'd be stupid to buy right now. Um, you know, if the daily chart's down here and it's that uh, end of the week type thing and I'm buying 200 bucks, I'll buy. I won't even really think about it. Boom, just buy. Okay, even if the price action moves down the next week, I buy 200 bucks more, you know, and I'm buying as it comes down. And then when it goes back up, I'm in uh, some good profits there. So, I was trying to waste some time just so I could see this. Yeah, it's still going there, guys. I'd like to do a withdrawal in this video, but if I can't, that's fine. We'll uh, just end the video here. And yeah, guys, um, I'll probably do another video tomorrow to, to uh, just make some more withdrawal proof because that'll be like 2K that I'm withdrawing out. Oh, I never did this though. Okay, so we, I want to add this up in my currency just because that's, 
the number that I need to think about. I don't care about U.S. dollar, right? I, I want to make U.S. dollar, but I only care about my currency. So I made $3,037 U.S. this week, and then which is a really good week for me. And then I go USD to CAD. I just want to see how much this is. Yeah, 3800 bucks, guys. Holy smokes. That's good. $3,800 profit this week with my commissions and my, uh, um, the monthly, uh, income there guys, the well weekly income basically. So that's it. See you guys. Bye-bye. Today was four Oh five.